Today, I am going to share useful settings to improve performance in COD Mobile on Gamaloop Emulator. Hear these two notes before we start. One, your internet connection quality affects on the game's stability while playing. It may cause you lag and FPS drop when you meet real players, and also Gamaloop is not very optimized for COD Mobile like PUBG Mobile, so I am showing this settings based on my own tests, and I chose best settings for all devices. Hello fellas, before we start pushing the frames, make sure that you meet the requirements. A CPU with 4 cores and 8 threads will do the job, 16 gigabytes of RAMs are more than enough, a graphic card with 3 gigabytes of memory and DirectX 11 supported will make you jump in the battlefield. If you already installed Gamloop, make sure that you have the 32-bit version because it's very stable more than the 64 version. And if you want to check which one do you have just run any game, and check the top left of the corner in Gamaloop if it's showing Gamaloop beside the logo that mean that you have 32-bit version and you are good to go. And if it's showing 64 beside beta, you need to uninstall Gamaloop and download the 32-bit version. If you want to download Gamaloop 32-bit version, go to your browser and type gamaloop.com Hit enter and choose 32-bit version. Now go to Windows settings and click on gaming, then click on gaming mode, then graphics and click on browse and locate where Gamaloop is installed and choose Android emulator EN, then click on options and choose high performance. If you have an AMD graphic card, go to your AMD software and add Android emulator EN.exe then do the same settings. For NVIDIA users, make the same settings on your NVIDIA software. Now head to Gamma Loop settings and do the following. If you have a good graphics card, choose DirectX mode for best quality and average performance. And if you have a weak graphic card, choose OpenGL for the best performance with low quality. If you have APU like integrated graphic in your CPU and you don't have a graphic card, uncheck prioritize discrete graphics card and uncheck vertical sync. Turn off anti-aliasing. For the memory, choose the half of your total memory. For processor, choose the same of your CPU cores. For the resolution, choose the same with your desktop resolution. Match this settings with the previous settings. For the last step, go to Windows Security, click on Virus Threat Protection, then Manage Settings and scroll all the way down to Add or Remove Exclusions. Then add an exclusion for Gamloop folder. This is enough for the moment. That was me, your host Frex. Thanks for watching and goodbye for another video.